Hey everyone, I'm here with Brandon Banks. How you doing, Brandon? I'm doing well. How you doing? Thanks for having me. Oh, no problem. Thank you. I'm doing great. Uh, are you ready to open some 2020 Upper Deck CFL? Oh uh, man, I'm excited. I can't wait to see what awesome cars we have in the 2020 edition. Awesome. I kind of recognize this guy on the on the front here too. It's yeah, that's just a guy uh, from the Helmet Tight cast, uh, former MOP of uh, the league, guy by the name of Brandon Banks. Uh, oh, but, <laughs> but no, it's definitely an honor uh, to be on the box. Uh, it's pretty neat, a pretty exciting deal to uh, have. Uh, I'm happy to be partnered up with Upper Deck and to make this happen. And it's pretty dope to see myself on the box like that. I mean, it's a dream come true. You know, growing up as a kid, seeing trading cards and stuff like that, you'll never imagine yourself on the front of something. So it's pretty awesome. Well, that's awesome. I'm glad you're out there. And why don't we start with the pack one? Let's see okay, what pack one. Let's see what I got open up here. Okay. Wow. Well, as soon as I open up, I have a former teammate, uh, Greg Ellison, uh, who's one of the top receivers in the league. Awesome to play against him. He actually knocked us out from going to the Great Cup a couple years ago, so I'm still kind of highly upset about that. <laughs> but uh, we also have Andrew Harris in this uh, pack. Uh, we also have Mar oh Marcus Stampin. Uh, he's a speedster like me, a former NFL guy that I know from a while back. That was Pretty number to 165, too. That was oh, yeah. On the top right. Okay. Uh, 135 out of 165. Nice. Nice. That's yep. just hit for facts. Nice. Let's shoot for another pack. Pretty neat, though. Pretty hard to open. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I should go to the side. Oh, okay. Yeah, you try the other side, too. Sometimes it works on one of the sides. Here we go. There we go. And the second pack. Have the the the, the most, best quarterback of the league right now. As soon as I open it up, Bo Levi Mitchell, uh, pretty good guy. Um, who else we have in this league? Up, oh, we have a number one. Well, it's Bo Levi Mitchell again. It's uh forty three out of fifty. Oh, nice. So it's pretty awesome uh, to have Bo Levi. I actually hung out with him at a Great Cup week one weekend. So he's pretty awesome, cool guy. Oh, we got to shout out my teammate. We got Jay Tug in there, well, former teammate. I think he signed with another team in the free agency. But uh, uh, good to see him in a uh, nice pack. I definitely put that in my collection. <laughs> put that card aside. Yep. All right, third pack. Let's see if we can get it open a little bit easier. All right, Pat, let's see what kind of guys we got in here. Oh, we got one of the most versatile, my friend, one of my good friends of the league, Vernon Adams. And then in this part, we got a number card. Uh, I don't know this guy. Uh, I haven't seen him before, but uh, he looks pretty good. But it's 22 out of 50. He's a Calgary guy. Nice. So I guess what is the lower you closer, the better the card is, value card is? Yeah, yeah, lower the number. Sometimes it could be one of ones, which are in here Ooh. in this box. Okay. Maybe only one of, one of one. It'd be one of the world nice. like hers. So we open up the four pack. Okay, let's see who we have in here. The number. Oh, I've got to shout out my boy J Roll. We got him in here. Cornerback, Ty Cash. He actually from North Carolina as well. Oh. We got a Jersey one. Oh, nice. And my boy. This is my good friend of mine, BJ Cuddyham. That's nice. my homie. Your first big hit of the box. That's awesome. Yep. Nice. Yeah, we definitely got to shout out my boy Larry Dean, who's back with, back home with the Hamilton Tiger Cats. So I guess the big Jersey card was a, was a pretty dope one in that pack. Yeah, that's a big card. Yeah. That's a big card. So how is it uh, seeing your your friends on trading cards? Is man, it, is it funny like said, opening man, these guys? I mean, it's like a dream come true. I mean, you can never, as a kid growing up, you just see other stars and people that you admire on cards like now. But then now to see yourself on it, man, it's, it's just unbelievable. It's crazy that you actually, you know, grew up doing the living your dream really and getting, you know, pretty much somebody knowing how good good of an athlete you are to put you on a trading card. I mean, it's pretty dope. Well, we gotta open one of your cards. So, okay. The next pack. Let's see. 
Got another. Uh, my boy Nate Holly. We got a uh, sixty out of one hundred and sixty-five. He's a pretty good special teamer. Uh, every time we play Calgary, we got to make sure you know where he at on the field <laughs> all the time. <laughs> pretty good guy. Uh, we got a tie cat in here. You know, I got to shout out my boy, uh, Sirocco. Oh, we got a uh, CFL legend in here, too, man. This, this guy going out into the Hall of Fame, man. Sack man, Charles Houston. Just want to give a shout out to him, the OG. Like the pose there, too. <laughs> yeah, you know, you're a pretty savvy guy, man. Go to the next pack. We can find that one on one. Hopefully, the one on one will be you. That'd be awesome. Oh, man. Hopefully, that sounds good. Well, when I open this one, got a teammate. I always got to shout out my teammates. We got Big Nick. Because what we got in here. Oh, we got another number one, Big Jamal Campbell. We have an 18 out of a 50. Oh, nice. From Toronto. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, shout out my homie uh, Perez. I hung out with him a couple of times. Great cut. We, we did some work together. He's a pretty cool guy, kicker. So did you used to collect uh, trading cards when you were younger? Uh, I wouldn't say I was a big collector, but when I got my eyes on some cards of athletes that I, I admire, uh, I remember, like I said, uh, growing up as a kid, I caught my eyes on, like, this golden Michael Jordan card. And I thought it was like the awesome thing to have because I, I love Michael Jordan. And I also remember always having this Barry Sanders card because that was my favorite athlete growing up of all time. So, like, just have, I probably remember having like two cars that I always kept. I wasn't a big collector, but I, I remember having cars around the house. <laughs> uh, for the next pack, we have a 50 out of 50, uh, Avery Ellis, BN from Ottawa. Pretty good guy. He's definitely a, a factor. Oh, I got a college uh, teammate, William Powell, in this one. This was a good friend. Good playing against him at all time. Okay. Next pack. You're pretty good at opening these packs. You're not bad. Yeah. Got a little rhythm down now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And this pack, let me see some big guys. We have a 135 out of 165, Shane Bergman, Calgary, Lyman. Uh, let's give a shout out to Aaron Grimes, though. He's a pretty good defensive player uh, for uh, BC Lions. It's hard to play against him every, every week. Pretty good defender. One Is there the a certain, certain team that you don't like to play against? Uh, like in uh, strong I don't want to play it against you guys, or uh, I wouldn't say that because I'm so competitive. But one team that I always just like, oh, here these guys go against, probably Sass because yeah. they fans. <laughs> I hate playing with fans, and then they always is a pretty good defense. Man, they have one of the best defenses. So I hate playing against Sass. I open up the next play. I got my boy Serge, who in the NFL doing his thing right now. Serge Cash. Um, let's see. We have a one oh four. We have a one oh four out of a one sixty five. John Crockett, wide receiver out of Ottawa. That pack. Okay, let's go to the next one. Well, we have another either autograph. Well, we do have another autograph, and either another autograph or a jersey card coming. Still, you got two okay. big hits still coming in this box. Okay, we got seven packets more to open. This pack. Let's see. Just going to shout out to Mike Riley, OG of the league. Oh, got an autograph one. Oh, there we go. By my boy Nathan Rosenvelt, man. Definitely one of the toughest receivers in the league. Always competing every week. Try to keep me on my toes. But, man, it's pretty dope. Nice. Uh, pretty dope to see Nathan autograph. I'm definitely going to put that one in the collection. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you talk that one right up. You see a lot of these guys, you're gonna be like, Hey, I just opened some of your cards in the CFL box. Right. Yep. I must <laughs> definitely send them a couple of messages to my guys. Let's see. This pack. Let's see. We got a one thirty five out of a one sixty five David Bird center from Edmonton. All right. Next package. Yeah, I guess I feel it. It's gonna be something on this one. 
Oh, sure. I gotta shout out my boy Sharad Baltimore from uh, around here. Hang out with him a lot. He's a good friend of mine. Okay, we have a 75 out of a 165. Tyler, good kicker. I remember we playing against him a good time, a couple of times. You gotta open some of your cards. We gotta find one of your cards in there. Man, where I'm at? I'm gonna be the last of the last. Huh? We're in front of the box, but we haven't got a trading card yet. <laughs> <laughs> Not one. All right, next package. Uh, have a checklist card uh, where we have two players on it. Uh, we got Muamba and Cameron Judge. That's a pretty dope card. Two of the top linebackers in the league. Uh, then we have a 146 out of a 165. We got Big Gibby, Jesse Gibby, my boy on my team. This must be set up. I must set up the cards for me to be the last of the last. Have a great ending. Last pack mojo. <laughs> Three more packs left. Okay, let's see what's in this one. Okay, we got a 145 out of a 165. Kyra Moore, he's definitely a playmaker in the league. Always making big time plays, punt returns. And two more. So you got to have some in both of these packages. <laughs> Oh, first one I open up, I see you got a shout out to my boy Jeremiah Masoli. Healthy comeback, bro. Miss you out there on the field. Well, we got an autograph. Oh, nice. And one. one of the top playmakers in the game, my boy, VA Burn Adams. Hey, this is a real vibe pack of cards right here. Yeah, you did really well. Two autographs in the box. That's awesome. Right. Nice. Nice you done. Right. Ah. We're all good. <laughs> Okay, and last pack. I hope it I'm might back. be for you. Find yourself. You guys, hear Brandon Banks in there. <laughs> right. I said I said this up pretty well for it to be the last one. Come on. Well, we got to shout out my boy Dude Kane. He from around the way. I hang out and train with him. We got a we got a, a nine out of one sixty five. You know you got a shout out to the lot of talker in the game, Simone. Well, look like this pack done it exists with Speedy B in it. No, oh, but at least you're on the box. At least I'm on the box. Yeah, but I think man, that makes up for it. Right. <laughs> There's a lot of valuable cards in here, though. A lot of great athletes in here, especially this uh, autograph signed one by Bernie Adams, who are taking over the, the Montreal organization. That's going to be a pretty big, big card to have. It's pre my homeboy. That's awesome. Oh, yeah. Thank you very much, Brandon, for doing this. I really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, this is awesome. I'm so happy to, to have you join us in opening this uh, 2020 Upper Deck CFL box. And we look forward to seeing you next year. Uh, thanks for having me, man. It was an awesome time and can't wait to see what the next edition has in it. Awesome. Thanks, Brandon. Thank you.